more I read into it, the more I realized that I'll be missing out by not showing up here. It's not just a technical conference. You have people from very different verticals all assembling here. And you have the ones who have the funds to make it happen. I've never seen a conference with so many representatives from national security space, commercial space, civil space, and the scientific community all kind of converging here at the same time. I give credit to AIAA for what they've done here. Our experience at Ascend has been terrific. It's great having all the movers and shakers of industry talking about what's happening and what the trends are. We all have the same passions. We're all facing similar problems. And getting to hear those different perspectives and how we can help one another. We cheer for each other and we want each other to succeed. So I think that's my favorite part, just the camaraderie that's here and the collaboration that I've already experienced. So I'm looking forward to days two and three. My favorite part of Ascend has been reuniting with all of my space friends. It's so cool. Everyone's so excited and so passionate about space exploration. So it's just been really cool to be here. Coming here and listening to other speakers, that really gives me a different mindset and bigger picture of, wow, it has so many things within the single, with all of this experience that I'll be getting from Excel, I can contribute more to the body of knowledge. I think it's been great, fascinating, um, entertaining as well, and also um, educating and enlightening. So I got the opportunity to come here as a diversity scholar. I have met people that I've read about since I was little. I got to meet Dr. Ellen Ochoa. I've known about her since I was in Colombia and I was little. So far it has been amazing. My Ascent experience has been phenomenal. This is something I always wanted to do since I was in high school. I didn't know AI really existed up until two years ago. And I'm just so happy that I got to meet these very wonderful individuals, as well as network with professionals on various companies. I have found being here as an educator, we need to start teaching math with much different perspectives. What do we as educators need to do just in our elementary classrooms to be able to provide a platform for these students to be doing these jobs, 21st century skill jobs in the future?